Hi friends. In the last session, we have started that aliasing and cloning of list objects, right? So in the last session, we have started that aliasing and cloning of list objects. Normally, what is aliasing and cloning means uh, the process of giving another reference variable to the existing list. Okay, the process of giving another reference variable to the existing list is nothing but aliasing. Okay, how we can do aliasing means uh, just uh, taking new variable and assigning the content. So the problem with this approach is if you are changing the information in the aliasing object, so original list also will get affected. Okay, original list also will get affected. So to prevent this problem, we can resolve by using two ways. One is by using slice operator. Second one by using copy function. Okay, now we'll observe what is slice operator and what is a copy function. Right, first one by using by using slice operator. Okay, first one by using slice operator. Observe carefully by using slice operator. First I'm taking. See here first uh, I'm taking list. Okay, I'm taking I'm printing that list uh, and uh, I'm printing that ID of that list also. Okay, I'm taking the list, I'm printing that list and I'm printing the ID of the list also. Next what I'm doing means uh, I'm taking ls1 is equal to ls1 is equal to ls of ls of aliasing. So you know everyone know if I'm not giving starting and ending means it's going to consider the total list. Okay. It's considered the total list. Okay. Now I'm printing that list. Okay. Now I'm what I'm doing. Now I'm printing that list. LS1 and LS1. After, after cloning. Cloning by using slice of slice operator. After cloning by using slice operator ID. <coughs> See, observe here. Now here and here we'll observe the different ID. Okay, now we'll observe the different ID. If you observe here 9040, Both are same content but different objects. I mean different ID same content but different IDs it will generate okay and if you observe here and if you observe here what I am doing now now I am changing ls1 ls1 is equal to ls1 of 1 ls1 of 1 is equal to I am taking triple nine double nine double nine Okay. Now observe. Okay. I'm taking, I'm printing that and uh, print uh, original list. Original list. Okay. Original list. <coughs> original list is nothing but ls. Now observe, observe the output. So first ID, this is the one. After cloning by using slice operator ID, this is the one. After cloning by using slice operator, this is the one. That means what I am doing here, I am changing the content. Okay, I am changing the content of LS1. So this one and this one both are same. <coughs> that means observe here LS also print ls1 see first id this is the one so after cloning this is the second one okay if you observe here this is the ls1 okay this is nothing but ls1 and uh, id is nothing but this one and if you observe here original list this is the one so let me print the original ID. Original ID. Original ID. If you observe here, whatever the first one is there, 
the same thing it is printing but that means in the original list it is not affecting cloning you have created content is got changed so id will be the in that case right so this is the way first case is by using slice operator okay first case is by using slice operator okay don't worry i will explain with the diagrammatic then you will get clarity see observe here what i am doing means uh, okay observe here first this object is pointing to ls okay first this object is pointing to ls ls is pointing to this object okay ls is pointing to this object when ls1 is after creating slice operator so next content is is next it is going to create this new list object okay after you are changing to triple nine triple nine okay triple nine triple nine now here the content is going to change so in that way here it is giving the different id here and here both are different okay but if you observe here here five will be there here triple double line double line but id from the first side and the last original case also id is the same okay so this is nothing but by using slice operator okay this is nothing but by using slice operator so next one okay if you are having any questions just to watch the video one more time you will get clarity slice operator means uh, we are creating another object by using this way so when it is created so this list and this list both are different ids both are having different ids but content wise both are same only okay content wise same only but ids wise different right so now observe the next one okay now observe the next one is nothing but by using copy function 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 <coughs> see the same information what i have used here but just here what i am going to do is uh, ls1 is equal to ls dot copy okay ls dot copy ls1 is equal to ls dot copy except this remaining everything is same okay except this remaining everything is same observe here see here here this id and this id both are same but once you created cop cloning by using slice of copy function let me write copy function <coughs> okay copy function copy function <coughs> clear right here id and here id both are different <coughs> so here and here content got changed by using copy function so that's why here case here case both are different okay here case and copy function id is both are different that means the same diagrammatic okay the same diagrammatic the content here what is there so once created ls1 here the content will change to double nine double nine okay double nine double nine instead of five so that is <clears throat> that is what we are observing here 
clear right <clears throat> if you are having any questions or queries please post your query in the comment section okay i will help you for your clarity okay so just to what we observed by using slice operator and by using copy function slice operator means so it is going to create the new object whenever it new object is created this this list and this list both are different and they are having different ids if you observe here <coughs> and here next copy function also the same as a slice operator only but except here here we are take, creating a list by using in this way here we are creating by using this way <coughs> theory wise same but uh, creating wise uh, this is the different one okay thank you friends thanks for watching this video if you are having any questions or queries please post your query in the comment section or reach out to my email id if you are having if you are watching my channel for the first time please subscribe to my channel thank you friends